Hey Allison, I'm Lindsay. Uh, thanks for sharing in your video. Um, I really enjoyed how you spoke about mutual respect um, and respecting your client's values. I felt like that uh, aligned very much with uh, my own personal golden rule um, of counseling, which was to be open to receiving and accepting what others bring to me. Yeah, that was the first part at least. And um, I feel like those ideas are very similar. We're wanting to receive and accept whatever our client is bringing to us and to uh, whether we relate to it or not or whether we um, have the same values that they do. Um, I also loved your honesty about <laughs> the social justice act um, or what action you want to do. Um, we so often are exposed to what not to do in the news and uh, newspaper and internet and stuff and we often see the acts of racism and um, what's socially unjust. Uh, so it's hard for us to have an example of something that is socially reconciling. Um, that's partially why my action was to read a book first um, and then learn how to navigate these situations and how to become um, a social reconciler in my community. A Bible verse that means a lot to me is Deuteronomy 31.8. It says, it is the Lord who goes before you. He will be with you. He will not leave you or forsake you. Do not fear or be dismayed. Um, I love this verse because it's very comforting. Um, I often uh, prefer following than leading, and I usually want someone else to do something before I do it. Um, and so I find so much comfort in knowing that the Lord goes before me and does um, things before me and that he um, won't ever leave me alone. He'll always be with me in whatever I'm experiencing.